must challenge his liar who accused him of sexual misconduct to describe his private parts. Well, we all knew that they were going to be coming for <laughs> Elon once he, he started uh, saying we should be adhering to our First Amendment rights um, on social media platforms. And he even said that they're going to be coming. <laughs> they're going to be coming for him soon. And lo and behold, they sure did with this uh, 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 sexual misconduct allegations. But before we get started, go ahead, hit that like button, share this out so we can get this information out there. Also, subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. Hit that alarm bell so you know when I'm putting out new stuff. Also, check out my link tree in the description. It has a link to my Patreon where I talk about things I can't talk about here. Um, there's also a link to my merch store where I have Let's Go Brandon t-shirts. I will not comply t-shirts. Check those out. And then there's another link to my mental health coaching and consultation page. If, if you're suffering from any type of uh, mental health issue, anxiety, depression, um, I can teach you how to cope through that, how to manage that. I can teach you coping skills and different relaxation tricks. So uh, check that out also. All right, let's talk about this news. Elon Musk challenge the woman who accused him of sexual misconduct to describe the details of his intimate body parts that are quote known or that are quote not known by the public in a bid to disprove her claims i think that's hilarious <laughs> quote but i have a challenge to this liar who claims their friend saw me exposed describe just one thing anything at all scars tattoos that isn't known by the public she won't be able to so because it never happened. Musk tweeted Friday in response to a Twitter use, uh, user asking what the accusations were. A famous flight attendant, I'm sorry, not famous, a former flight attendant uh, working on a contract basis in the cabin crew for SpaceX's corporate jet fleet accused Musk of exposing his erect penis to her, rubbing um rubbing her leg without consent and offering to buy her a horse in exchange for an erotic massage inside a reported last week. The incident alleged allegedly took place in 2016. The woman reported the incident to the company's human resources department and must space X and um, the attendant ultimately entered a $250,000 severance agreement in 2018 inside a reported must who is also the CEO of Tesla, denied the sexual misconduct claims to the outlet, calling the story a, quote, political motivated hit piece. Quote, if I were inclined to engage in sexual harassment, this is unlikely to be the first time in my entire 30-year career that it comes to light, he wrote. He also took to Twitter and said that the claims should be viewed as political, must had said earlier last week that he will vote Republican in future elections after overwhelmingly voted Democrat in previous elections. Quote, the attacks against me should be viewed through political through a political lens. This is their standard despicable playbook, but nothing will deter me from fighting for a good future and your rights to free speech, the SpaceX CEO wrote on Twitter on Thursday. And amen to that. He's, he's continued to fight. We knew this. This is this is what they do. They 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 try to call you, uh, hit you with sexual harassment, or they, then they try to call you a racist and a homophobe and all these other things. They just keep throwing things at at you, throwing these allegations at you, and hopefully hope that you go away or people stop listening to you. But we understand the tricks. They do it every single time to every single person, especially if you are conservative or have any type of uh, libertarian view. But a friend of the attendant detailed the incident in a signed declaration. But see, this is the thing. It's not even firsthand. This is not even coming from the so-called victim. This is coming from a friend of the so-called so-called victim. This is despicable. And and people are listening to to this like it's coming from the person that that that's making the allegations. Twitter users asked why the friend would come forward years later, which must responded. To by saying the friend is a far left activist actress in LA with a major political axe to grind. Wow. Musk recently announced he intends to buy Twitter for $44 billion and take it private, but suggests Saturday the buyout price should be slashed by the number of bots accounts on the platform. And I agree. If 25% of the users are bots, then the Twitter acquisition deal should cost 25% less. 
Twitter user Ian Miles uh, Chong tweeted Saturday, absolutely must respond it. Musk has um, put the buyout on hold until Twitter can po- prove that only 5% of his users are bots. But we'll see what's, what's going to happen with this. But let me know what you think about all this. Leave your comments down below. Like, share, and subscribe. And check out democrepublics.com for the latest in news. Until next time, peace.